Hey guys, it's Tiffany from supereasymath.com. Today's math problem of the day says, at a grocery store warehouse store, 80 ounces of mustard cost $5. What is the cost per ounce of the mustard? Well, in order to solve this, I'm going to take our cost, which is the $5, and I'm going to divide the 80 into it. Well, the first thing I like to do is bring my decimal up, and I know that 80 cannot go into five or 50. It's gotta go into the 500. And it goes in there six times, which is 480. Please note that I put the six on top of the last zero because I was dividing 80 into 500. If I were dividing it into five or 50, I would put it above the last digit of each of those numbers. It has to be at the last digit place. However, that does give me an empty space here, so I need to add a zero in it. Now you subtract, you get 20, bring down a zero. Then I ask myself how many times is 80 going? 200. It goes in two times, which is 160. I get a remainder of 40, and then I add another zero. And I know that the 80 is gonna go into the 400 five times. So the answer to this problem is kind of a weird number. Although the number amount looks a little different because typically when we're dealing with money, we only deal with numbers up to two spaces after the decimal. So what this means is the cost of one ounce isn't exactly a coin amount it falls in between two cent amounts which is okay because when you add them all up it's still going to equal an even five dollars which is fine because nobody's going to be buying a single ounce they're going to buy a full 80 ounces at a time and you guys i would really love it if you help me out by clicking that like button for this video and subscribing to that channel it really helps me so i can continue to produce these videos here's tomorrow's math problem of the day See if you can solve it before I do, but don't forget to head over to supereasymath.com, click on math videos, and you can get access to all of my videos where I teach everything in order with notes the way you need it.